Hi, this is Adam with Wholesale Septic Supply. Today we're going to talk about control panels, what certain control panels do. Uh, we're going to have a uh, summarized listing down below. And also when you go to videos, you can go to different uh, content for different types of septic stuff. So control panel, risers, pumps, aerators. We're going to have all that organized so you guys can find what you're looking for quickly uh, and get the knowledge that you need. So we're going to start over here with the simplex panels and the simplex panel is basically for one pump and that's what simplex means. This is a very uh, basic simplex panel here. All it does is uh, control one pump, 115 volts, got a 20 amp breaker, that will go up to a half horsepower. Uh, it's used for, uh, most of the time it's used for shops, uh, things like that, just you need a little lift station and it pumps it over to the other, you know, it pumps it over to the main septic system. This one here is a simplex dosing panel. So let's say you have a tank with a dose in it. Uh, this is the panel that you would get. It's got this clock in here that you can adjust so you can turn the pump on and off uh, based on how much flow you want to go over. So we'll go more into that on this panel and how that happens uh, when we do the in-depth video on this panel. So. That's a uh, dosing panel. This is just 115 volt duplex. So <clears throat> we had to rob some parts out of this to help a customer out when uh, there was a shortage. But this is just 115 volt. It's got a real simple uh, controller. It's got two of these. These are the contactors for it. So they're uh, 20 amp contactors and they're solid state. So they don't, they don't make a bunch of noise. But anyways, this is a duplex panel for a uh, 115 volt. Then you have a duplex panel that is for a 220, and you'll see the difference in this is that it's uh, much bigger. Breakers are double throw. You have big contactors here. There's that pump, and then there's that pump. So when these close, uh, that turns on. The reason they do that on this panel is because the float doesn't take the load. The contactor actually takes the load. So uh, the relay kicks off and it sends it out of there and turns the pump on. So uh, this panel here is a basic aero aerobic panel. So on aerobic panels, you have a pump and an aerator and you need an alarm. So on this panel here, this is for an on-demand. So uh, the pump tank turns on or fills up. The pump comes on automatically and uh, fills up everything. And the pump comes on and uh, you know pumps the tank down and then that's it. You have an alarm and uh, you have this for the pump. So that turns the pump on and off. Very basic panel. So it's real simple, real easy, and we'll go into this panel as well. But this is a very common type panel. Uh, it's very simple to, to work on, easy to hook up. I mean, it's got everything's labeled, so it's very simplistic. So it's a very popular panel. This panel here um, is a timer panel. So in a lot of areas, you'll have what we have is... Um, <clears throat> sprinklers that can only go off at a certain time and usually it's nighttime. So they'll put them on a timer and the timer will determine when that will go off. These panels are a little more complicated, not, not, not too much more, but uh, they have some uh, override floats on them because if the tank level gets too high in there it'll automatically kick off before the timer kicks in uh, just so you don't flood the system. But uh, this is a timer panel, it's a very common timer panel. So all our panels are, are made by uh, RJR here in Texas. Uh, we're the only one that sells them online that I know of. Uh, they make great panels. They're really thick. Uh, they don't, you, you get screws, but we don't like the screws. So we use these latches. Latches are really good. They're a thick panel. So a lot of guys like these panels just because of this. A lot of the installers like them because they're thicker and they're just a nicer panel than most panels that are out there. So. Um, that's basically it. We're going to go into the individual panels. And uh, if you guys have any questions or comments, please ask them. And we'll be happy to answer for them for you. And we'll go from there. I hope you guys have a great day.